I greet you in Jesus' precious name. It is Monday morning, the 28th of October, 2024, and this is your friend, Angus Bucket, with a thought for the day. We start off in the book of Ezekiel, chapter 33, verse 5. He heard the sound of the trumpet, but did not take warning. His blood shall be upon himself, but he who takes warning will save his life. And then we go to the book of Hebrews, chapter 2, verse 3. How shall we escape if we neglect so great a salvation? We need to listen for the sound of the trumpet calling. It's a warning, my dear friend, for the time is running out. I just feel in my heart I'm speaking to a man at the moment, and maybe a woman as well, who is continually digging your heels in and you're saying, tomorrow I will make my peace with the Lord. But the trumpet is blowing. The Lord is saying, this is the day that you need to seek me with all your heart. This is the day that you need to make your peace with God. A long time ago, I heard a beautiful story about a miller. You know the old-fashioned mill where it had a wheel and a little stream running past And the water turned the wheel. And the wheel turned the two huge grindstones. And they ground the corn into meal. And this miller was very hardworking. But he was totally obsessed by his work. He wasn't interested in anything to do with the Lord. But he got very sick. And his family was worried about him. And they realized the old gentleman was dying. They called an evangelist in. Please come and tell our dad about Jesus because he's going to meet the Lord very shortly. And they came down to the mill and the old man was now bedridden. And what he had done is he had asked him to put the bed right next to the grindstone so that he could hear the wheels grinding the corn and making money for him. And the evangelist walked up and he started to say to him, Sir, Please, the trumpet is calling. Home time is arrived. You need to make your peace with Jesus. And he kept saying, I can't hear you. I can't hear you because of the noise of the mill grinding the corn. And eventually he died and he went to hell. Folks, I want to tell you, we've got to speak up. I want to pray with you today. I just feel that there is a man and a woman listening to this program, who have never made a commitment to Christ. You know what to do. You know what you're supposed to do, but you've been so busy, busy with your work, busy with your vision, your ambition. If you are that person, I want to give you the privilege of praying this prayer with me, a simple prayer. Let us pray together. Dear Lord Jesus, I acknowledge today that I have been wasting valuable time. I ask you, therefore, to be my Lord and Savior, I am so sorry that I have been chasing after other gods like money and fame and ambition. Today, I accept you as my Lord and Savior. Amen. Jesus bless you and have a wonderful day. Goodbye.